here. Very good afternoon to you. Yeah, unsettled conditions are continuing. Now, this was the scene just before 7.30 this morning on the edge of Exmoor. Some wintriness over higher ground and some sleet there. And a couple of hours later, sunshine and showers for South Cornwall, the perfect recipe for that rainbow. Now, this is that band of rain that's been pushing through the southwest this morning. It's edged eastwards, behind it, scattered showers and some wintriness as well. Low pressure still dominates our weather, and as a result of that, the Met Office have issued a yellow warning for strong winds for tomorrow for the southwest. So we could see gusts in excess of 60 miles an hour, up to 70 along coastal stretches, particularly through the English Channel. There could be some travel disruption. Do take care tomorrow. It's this area of low pressure that's going to deepen into tomorrow, throwing in fronts once again, outbreaks of rain, strengthening winds, and that's when that yellow wind warning comes into force tomorrow. So we could see gusts inland in excess of 50 miles an hour, higher than that through coastal stretches. But for the rest of this afternoon, some sunny spells, but some showers as well. Some of those could be heavy and contain hail and thunder. The winds will whip up by the end of the day and a top temperature of 10 degrees Celsius. As we head through the afternoon and into tonight, some dry weather and then this band of rain moves in from the south and the east. That could be heavy and persistent and contain some wintriness once again over higher ground at around 400 metres and that minimum temperature falling away to just three degrees Celsius. So a wet and a windy start to Thursday morning with gusty winds tomorrow in excess at times of 50 miles an hour along coastal stretches following behind that squally showers to come tomorrow with the strength of those winds and a maximum temperature of around 11 degrees celsius for the channel islands this afternoon sunshine and showers a little bit of sunshine and then overnight tonight that band of rain pushes its way in that could be heavy and persistent the winds whip up overnight and by dawn tomorrow morning gusts in excess of 50 miles an hour so that minimum temperature for the channel islands falling away to just six degrees Celsius, but a windy start to the day tomorrow. A wet one as well with gale force strength winds for the Channel Islands tomorrow. Outbreaks of rain, some of that heavy, and we will hold on to those winds tomorrow throughout the course of the day. And the top temperature there, just 11 degrees Celsius. So those unsettled conditions continue for the next few days. Victoria, back to you. Shireen, thank you very much.